Hello and ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to my channel. I am Shout Nation, and I'm going to be bringing you another video on the Ethereum Forge. But today, I'm going to be showing you what happens after you've got all of the shards to go and open the place. So if you haven't seen my previous videos of how I got the shards, go over, check them out. They're on my channel. And um, don't forget to like, subscribe, maybe even leave a comment on them. Tell me what you think about them. Anyway, let's get into this video. First thing you want to do is you want to come over to the left side of your map. It's across from Ivanstead. It's the ruins of Bethaft. I think that's how you say it. Anyway, I've got the location discovered already, so I'm just going to head on over there. So when you get up here, there's going to be a few guards. What you want to do is you want to take them out. They're pretty easy. Depends on what level you are. I'm level 81, so they're a little bit harder, but I'm also on legendary, so it's wonderful. So you just want to take them out and then just keep moving. Get out of the shadow mirror. No, go away, go away. Okay, so here we want to be. I'm just going to let you listen. You made it, and you brought the shards. Yes, I have them. What now? Look at the device here. The gear in the center is just about the right size. Try putting the shards in, and we'll see what happens. Okay, so you heard the lady. Just chuck it in the center, and it will basically be all of them. Or one, yeah, two. Yeah, it's all of them. Try I'm assuming something. Taking it out? Okay, so you just take the Ethereum out. I'm guessing we need to stand clear. So come over here for safe. Cool. Just shot her up in the sky. Whoa, check it out. It's, it's true. It's all true. Come on, let's check it out. Okay. So this is the Ethereum Forge. Front door, I guess. I'm not certain. There's probably more before the city was destroyed. Well, technically this is just a preservation chamber. I'm okay with the dark, but I've spent more than my share of time in caves already. So I'm guessing there's a secret way to open this door. Well, check it out, no lockbox. In my previous videos, I've been showing you how to get heaps of gold, hidden chests, hey, watch it. all that kind of thing. Door doesn't. Oh, yep. Yeah. For blind people. Okay, so we're just gonna want to keep going through here. There's not very many enemies, I don't think. Probably a bear or two. Or a hidden dwarf. Dwemer. Probably right. Well, anyway, let's just keep going up here. This is a bit too quiet. I think there's something coming. Something going on here. Aha. Uh -huh. So what we want to do is we want to grab our bow. I've got a crossbow. Doesn't matter which one you use. 
And then you want to shoot the left one. And the right one. It's going to open the door. And just equip your weapon just in case there's any surprises. There always is. You may want to save before you go any further. Forge. Let's clear out the steam so we can take a look. There you have it. The Ethereum Forge. Yeah, again, don't forget to like and subscribe. It really helps me, like it's more for motivational things, so I know that I'm doing the right thing. Like, I'm doing the right video for you guys. Whether or not it is, I'm not certain. Anyway, let's get back to it. Oh look, more loot. Oh, come on. And there is also a hidden chest around here, it's just back there. But you need um resist fire. Like a lot of resist fire. It shouldn't be this bad for you because I'm on I'm on legendary, so it's gonna throw a lot more obstacles at me. Check that out, more loot. I don't really need it, but. It's always good to grab the small things. Oh no, it's a forge master. This is a great piece of machinery, the forge master. Was. Ha ha ha. In my video, Legendary Dragon. Yes, we did. There's only one thing left to do. We have to prove this actually works. That this is the real Ethereum Forge. Now oh, it's a real one, but how do we do that? By forging something, of course. Go ahead. After everything you've done, you should do the honors. There isn't any Ethereum here, is there? Damn it. Wait. Yes, yes there is. The shards we collected, they're pure ethereum, remember? It's not much, but it'll do. With them and the materials in this room, we should have everything we need. Okay. I don't know. I honestly don't know. After all these years, it's a miracle even this much survived. Make it count. This may be the only chance we ever get to use the forge. Okay, so let's go smith something. Not that I need anything. Four dwarven ingots, two refined. I don't want anything. Well, anyway, guys, there's um parts here, like stuff here you can use, obviously. Just 
just grab all that. That's all you'll need. I'll just make the shield. Well, anyway. Beautiful. That shield. It's everything I could have hoped for. And with that, it's done. No one could possibly deny what we found now. What now? For me. I've done what I set out to do. But you, take that out into the world. And if anyone asks, tell them what we discovered, together. Congratulations and thanks. I have waited so long for this moment. We've found it, at last. And now, I think I can rest. Farewell, my friend, wherever your travels take you. Well, anyway, I'll do a quick... I'll, I'll show you the Ethereum shield. And then we'll... There we go. There you have it. The Ethereum shield crafted by the Ethereum Forge. If that doesn't make you happy, well, make a different, make the staff or the crown, it's up to you guys. Anyway, that's all for me. This is Shout Nation. Don't forget to like, subscribe and leave a comment. Peace!